Hi there, I'm Adrian Salisbury and welcome to another video in this Ecamm Live tutorial series. In this video I want to show you how to schedule a live broadcast into YouTube. So let's come over into here and destination is YouTube this time. We are making sure it should by default be broadcast into public and then instead of going live now using the live event, we're going to schedule event. And we put our title in here and we'll put a description in as well. I better just put that in in case anybody checks it out. So we're going to put this in for tomorrow, so the 21st, and we'll put it in for 1700 again. Now, normally I would drop an image in here for uh, convenience. I'm just going to drop that same one in again that I used before. Again, 16 by 9 formats. Uh, this one is set to 1280 by 720 is its size. Don't worry, it's not going to come out like a circle. And uh, all I've got to do then is hit schedule. And then we should be prompted when it does come up with a note about um, a setting we need to put in. Yeah. So uh, the broadcast has been scheduled. Note that the scheduled broadcast will not be visible on your channel until that you change the promote on my channel page settings in the broadcast advanced settings on YouTube. So let's visit the settings. Takes us over into YouTube. So here it is. Uh, here's our test live stream is the title. This is our description that's in here in the advanced settings down here. So what it's saying is, is promoting on my channel when the event is live. So literally when it goes live, it's going to say that it's it's up and going. So if we put this in, if I need to put this in two days before, because it won't kick into a day before for a few hours yet. So I'm now saying to promote this on my channel two days before the start time. When I hit save changes, and then view on my watch page. So here it is and it shows the event and it says live in 27 hours, set a reminder. How cool is that? And as before with Facebook, now that I've got this in here, um, if I come back in here, it will now give me an option. It knows that I've got one saved for five o'clock tomorrow. It will make a list of them in here. And I believe I'm right that unlike Facebook that only lets you schedule seven days ahead, I think you can go further than that with YouTube. So note over on the left here at the minute, there's nothing there. When I tick on this event, it says that it's in a day. It tells me that I can go to the settings from here. When I hit on test, it allows me to just do as it says and have a test run through. So it shows me on here the one that's already scheduled and when I'm ticked on it, it says that it's in one day. Now this will count down and as I get nearer to it, it will count me down in so many seconds and I can hit on here on test. And as that time comes up, it will then automatically start for me. I can end that test as and when I want. If I decide to quit out of Ecamm, close everything down, uh, when I come back into it, my event is still there. And then what I'm going to do now is to click on here and cancel it. Okay, so that's how you schedule a live event in YouTube. Now let's have a look in the next video at setting up some cameras, mics and things like that inside Ecamm.